little joy back with another thing up. Ciao. I know I haven't done any vlogging for a minute, but it has been so overwhelming. It's like, I don't know where to start. It's just a lot. And I know y'all heard that beep. <laughs> That's not in my room. I don't know. It's just so much. So, let me just show you one thing. Let me show you one thing. Listen, 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 listen. Linda, listen. Call down, Linda. Call down. Oh, wait. Before I show you that thing, right? I realized that I am not for everybody. Everyone won't embrace me for who I am. It's like, for some people, I'm like the annoying little sister. It could be the annoying older, but, you know, I, I kind of act like a kid sometimes. Okay, most of the time. And <laughs> I guess it's not for everybody. And so I realize everyone is not going to like crazy joy. Everyone isn't going to like the outspoken joy, the funny joy, the one who jokes around a lot. And it just baffles me, but I have to accept that I'm, everyone is not going to like me. And so I had a few experiences, you know, well, I guess I can be annoying. <laughs> and that's why I love people who just love me for me, with my flaws, with my craziness, and just accept me for me. So I need to accept that I'm not for everybody without going into a lot. <laughs> so anyway, yeah, I could be annoying, I guess. I guess. So I was talking to someone, they was like, no, don't you ever change. You're just you. Don't you change. And if somebody doesn't like it, I guess that's their problem. But I feel like I don't want to have to change to make you happy or to make you comfortable. I'd rather just stay away. So anyway. Ooh, Chai, put my teeth in. Ooh, I won't turn my head to this side. Okay, I won't turn my head to that side. So anyway, let me show you. Let me show you. See something in the window. They've been a little crazy at home. They little been a crazy at school. And then I started rebraiding my hair. So lots of late nights, 2.30 in the morning, 3.30 in the morning, and I'm still not done. But, and trying to get stuff ready to move out, you know, and Clinton, as you guys saw, Clinton is my son. If you don't know who he is, I did a video and he said he had a plan. Talk about Colorado, that he was moving there. And then I asked him, okay, so what's the plan? When, when you when you moving, buddy? What's going on? What's going on, buddy? And he's talking about, oh, that fell through. Okay, so what you gonna do? I, I'm trying to figure it out. Okay, you know our time is short. I was also frustrated with that situation as well because I gave them, I didn't give an ultimatum. You know, I, I told them how much they had to pay to contribute to the house and all those type of things. And you know, you about to be 22 years old. You gotta learn some responsibility, but baby, he did none of those things. Didn't help out with bills, didn't help out, you know, you living here, you work. You need to contribute. Didn't help out with the cell phone, nothing. Didn't buy any food for the house, but we'll eat up whatever I brought in here. So what I brought in here was very, very little. 
very little. If I want it to keep something, because it'll be gone like that, I have to put it in my personal fridge. I have a fridge in my closet, and it was just frustrating. You see, you know, I'm on a struggle bus and trying to help the girls, and you just living your best life. So, I don't know what he's going to do. He has not been here for several days, and you guys can say whatever you want, but at some point, you got to learn. At some point, you don't, I don't know, how long has he been back? Well over a year, right? You could have been safe for a car. You could have said, you could have done a lot of stuff. Baby, you think if I could just keep all my paychecks for a year? Baby. And do whatever I want or save for something big? What? What? The things I could accomplish? Hmm, you better ask somebody. So, let me close this door because that beep is getting on my nerves. So, it has been, you know, having to deal with him that, you know, the, the resentment bills. I'm like, if. I don't know what's beeping up in here. This ain't my room. I'm in, well, it was the girls or it was Bobby's room. Now Clinton stays in this room. Maybe it's that. Ooh, I gotta find all those things and put them back, y'all. It's just so much to do. And by the time I get this video up, I don't know. So let's just say by the time I get this video up, I'll probably have nine days to get out. It's a, a lot to have to do by myself. Like I said, he's an MIA. Um, it's just a lot to do. It's it's a little overwhelming. And you know, with my ADHD, if, if I get so overwhelmed, then it's almost like I'm I'm in slow motion. I feel like I'm in a, like a, 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 I'm spinning my wheels, but I'm not getting anywhere. Oh man. So I've been trying to downsize and give away a lot of stuff. So I have, this dresser right here, this is all his stuff. I don't want to take that. It's just so much. This bed, because before he was like, oh, I'm going to take the bed. Okay, so what you going to do? Because if it's going to go, it, it needs to go now. So I'm thinking about renting a U-Haul next Saturday. I don't know when I'll get this up, but whenever I rent the U-Haul, I have three days remaining to get out of here. And so I figured I don't want to rent the U-Haul now. I might as well use this last week and be in comfort <laughs> and sleeping in my bed <clears throat> before I take it. So I've given away a lot of stuff. I've taken a lot of stuff to school, thrown away a lot of stuff. So with that said, it's just so, so much and a lot of cleaning that I'm going to have to do. A ton of cleaning. And I guess the biggest part is really the dusting, the blinds, scrubbing the floor. So I started cleaning the fridge, so I got halfway done with the fridge. But then there were no laundry pods while well, I had to hide some. For myself because if I don't uh, my son will wash clothes about two or three times a week but won't buy no laundry dessert won't do that at all you know you can't buy anything that that's considered adulting and being responsible so I had to hide some so there were two laundry pods left gone and then I because I don't wash clothes every week I, I don't have to and then uh, so I saw him wash clothes I was like so you bought laundry detergent? He was like, no, I use the dish soap. Alright, alright. So I'm cleaning the fridge, ran out of dish soap. Cleaning dishes, cleaning up, you know, stuff I want to pack away. No more dish soap. So it's like, that's on hold now. I can't do anything with that until I buy more dish soap. So I want to go get a little dish soap. It's just, if it's not one thing, it's another. It's just one thing after the other. 
So about to embark on a new journey, a new phase. I don't know, some of you have been with me for a long time. Remember when I moved into this place? I think I've been here three to four years. I'm not sure. I definitely three years. So it could be four. I could be moving into my fourth year. So, but the owners have been really, really sweet, really nice. So it's just time to go. What the future holds, I do not know. So it's just a lot to do. So with that said, I'm gonna go make something to eat. I bought two avocados a couple of days ago. I wanted to try making some avocado toast, but I think the avocados don't went bad. <laughs> and then I need to go to Starbucks. Um, I like to get out of the house and work, to go to Starbucks and work because grades are due and uh, it's just a lot there too. So it's just a lot in this hair. I want to try to do a little, a few more braids tonight. And hopefully it won't take me to 2 in the morning. So I have not been sleeping well at all. It's just a lot at one time. Well, it just creeped up on me. I knew it was coming, so I guess it's my fault too. I don't have nobody to blame but myself. But with school and being a little overwhelmed with that... My hair. People say, why you, why you just don't take it out? No. Because once it's done, it's in there for about a good two months before I have to start rebraiding something. It's just the freedom of the braids and the freedom of just getting up and going. So, I like the braids. And some of my kids are like, when you going to do something different? When your grades are going to do something different? How about that? Don't worry about my braids. Worry about your grades. <laughs> and all those zeros in a grade book. How about that? <clears throat> okay. So I have some other tea for y'all. I have to do that later, y'all. I really need to get going on this day. But baby, I got some other tea for you. You remember Bay Daddy, honey? Mm-hmm. Mm-hmm. I gotta give you that tea, child. You gonna gag. You are going to gag, honey. Period. <laughs> All right, y'all. Give this video a thumbs up. I love you, love you, love you, and I will continue to update you on this journey, but I wanted to go in and give an update, so I'll probably try to edit this video very quickly while I'm in Starbucks, but it doesn't upload very quickly in Starbucks. So, that's what I'm going to do. And you know what? If I drink the coffee, the coffee actually, I believe the coffee makes me crash, but I like to eat before I go. You know I like food. You know y'all know I like food. You know I'm a slim girl. I'm slim. I'm slim thick, y'all. I'm slim thick. You know I'm a big girl. I'm a big girl, but in a slim thick body. That's why I'm thick. Y'all see? Y'all see my face? I'm thick, y'all. I'm slim thick. Yeah. <laughs> I like to eat. I like food. Oh, it's just good. It's just good. <laughs> See, Joy, stop being silly. Stop, Joy. Stop. <laughs> I'm going to try. And see, everyone doesn't like that. They, they just don't. They just annoy people. It's crazy. And I just find that there's some people that just don't like me. Just because I exist and I breathe, honey. It's just amazing. And I always say if somebody doesn't like me or get upset with me, that's their problem. It's not mine. Oh, well. So, but it's just like, it shocks me, though. It shocks me. That's why you are going to gag when you get this next tea. Gag, honey, gag. Because I'm like, me? Yeah. I guess I'm just annoying. I'm gonna put my teeth in so I can eat me a sandwich. <laughs> so I do have some egg salad, so I might do that. But let me see how the avocados look. I don't know. I'm getting hungry. Bye.